Sheila Whiteman versus the rock and roll band Total Slavery. <laughs> Your Honor, I'm a music fan. I'm not here to censor anyone's artistic expression. But we have to draw the line somewhere when innocent children are hurting themselves because of messages they've heard in rock lyrics. I present to you Exhibit A, the latest single from the band Total Slavery, entitled Put a Pick in Your Dick. <laughs> in their penises, but try telling that to Sheila Whiteman. Sheila? <laughs> My 12-year-old son, Jeremy, did put a pick in his penis, and now his penis no longer functions properly. Little, little Jeremy's penis is broken, and it's not getting any better. Oh, oh, man. Come on. Hey, man. Those lyrics are a metaphor for having a good time, all right? They're not meant to be taken literally. <laughs> Reach down, feel around. The time is right, so do it tonight. That pick is wide, but it fits inside. It's time to put a pick in your diddy dick. Your Honor, these are the exact same lyrics that Jeremy Whiteman was listening to the night he broke his young penis. Yo, it's not fair, man. This is one verse from one song. Okay, then. All right, then let's move on to the second. A real interesting love ballad called The Key. Miss Whiteman, do you mind? <laughs> Ride wild chariots across the sea. Wrestle the devil. You found the key. Complete the sin. It will fit in. <laughs> Shove a drumstick in your prick. Your Honor, these criminals are telling children to put ch drumsticks in their penises. That's not where our children should be putting their drumsticks. <laughs> Lawyer, lawyer, counselor, may I remind you this is not the Big Apple Circus and I am not a circus clown. Are we clear? <laughs> yes, Your Honor. The prosecution would like to call to the stand a Dr. Lauren Teapot. Oh, man, Teapot. <laughs> <laughs> As a medical professional, would you ever tell a young man to put a pick in his penis? No. No. No, you wouldn't. And you'd also never tell him, one is done, now it's time for more. Take a trip to the pick store. One's not enough, though it might be tough. Put two picks in your dick? No. No, you wouldn't, doctor. No, you wouldn't. And you also wouldn't tell him, don't worry how you'll pee, now's the time to try for three. Would you? No, I would not. That's all we need, Dr. Teapot. Thank you very much. <laughs> Your Honor, if it pleases the court, I'd like to do a bit of a demonstration. Yeah? All right, this is a Fender XG7 celluloid guitar pick. And this here hickory smoked sausage. <laughs> well, it represents a typical male penis. <laughs> Broken 
fucking dick is a direct result of listening to these song lyrics. Wait, Your Honor, we have a witness of our own. The defense would like to call to the stand 12-year-old Jeremy Whiteman. Come on, Jeremy. Got a little guy. Yeah. All right, Jeremy. Then why don't you tell the court exactly why you put a pick in your dick? Because my mom and dad both have jobs and no one's around to watch me. Bailiff, arrest that woman. Come on, everybody. You know what to do. Grab a pick and stab your dick.